So we try to read the cell voltages, the cell parameters of the DJ battery but unfortunately the chip got bricked and the E values we entered the wrong values or the, the backup file was wrong, corrupted something like that the chip got bricked we try to restore the values but uh, but fortunately with the help of the DJ battery killer community uh, we are able to get the chip back alive by connecting the positive voltage and the negative voltage directly to the chip uh, by using an external power supply basically the charging voltage is connected to the battery and the chip uh, again back to alive and uh, we try to read the values and this is the result we are able to get the values but unfortunately the device name the manufacturer data everything was corrupted so we need to reflash the rom again uh, fortunately i in every video i am i'm saying like that uh, we need to get all the backup before we doing anything so in this case we are we already back up our all the values like the firmware the rom the ifib the e values everything we have back backup and we just need to uh, restore the rom file here and then that changed the thing again uh, the chip alive again and uh, what what to say uh, the chip is working as the normal in the previous state but on uh, but this friend needs to change the cells and the charging voltage of the cells is just only 4.3 volt but the original battery was 4.4 volt so he wants to change the cells and he wants to change the charging voltages that's why he messaged me he can do that he tried to change but the battery is still getting into the 4.4 volt which is very dangerous for the lithium polymer battery and i try to help him but i i have done something wrong and the chip got bricked and i take the full responsibility and i, I asked to the dj battery killer community for the help and this was the result the guy in the my telegram uh, group he he responded properly and he given the video and that video led to the the result this is completely uh, resolved the problem the battery is again getting charged and i changed the charging voltages to the normal voltage it is very simple we can just given the input values to the each cell the the, the v max also the veoc the end of charge voltages we just need to given the lower value if it is your battery is 4.3 volt that is 4300 millivolt then we just give the eoc as 400 uh, 4299 or 90 voltage so that is something just like that the millivolt the not the voltages it's in the millivolt so just like that and we can charge the battery and he able to charge the battery to up to the 4.3 volt so after writing the values go to the unseal section and click on the it enable the black box reset and of also the lifetime reset this is compulsory this is a procedure because uh, i saw so many videos like this and they are also following this kind of procedure in the professional tools uh, but this will not uh, getting to anything wrong this will only reset some values just do like this and this is the result we are able to get our battery back to alive maybe for your case uh, if after reading the value maybe you are charging current and the charging voltages is showing as zero don't worry for our case this was also the same uh, this must be showing some voltages like the 2 to uh, 2000 milliampere and the 70 voltages as the charging current and the charging voltages but unfortunately in our case it was zero it's just a random case or a normal case because the cells needs to turn on that is why uh, the cells need the, the uh, for the laptop batteries we need to connect the system present like that to read the values and in the DJ battery I don't know the working function but if you write the ROM again uh, the value will show again uh, so it's just not a uh, we, we don't need to worry about it just connect the charger and charge the battery again this will give you a good result a huge thanks to the DJ battery killer community and thanks for this my neighbor country friend my brother thanks for this opportunity and thanks for all of the person who are watching this video thanks to all feel free to use my comment box and once again thank you